Hey, hey guys and girls, it's Slingers time again, and it's back to nature with some tree themed covers. I'm your host, the Grey Man. I am a mighty sequoia, and I'm joined by the following struggling saplings of the comic community. The man who is often stumped, seldom twigs onto that fact, and we all wish he'd leaf. It's Comic Mag's musings. Hey, there he is. <laughs> well, let's see him. This guy is just about okay. It's Splat Comics. Yeah, Darren, as he sometimes known. This guy is like a Christmas tree. He has drooping baubles and often has a fairy on top of him. It's Captain Comics. That's true. Hey, Cap. Hello, <laughs> Sailor. Oh, he's a lovely He's a lovely oh, boy, oh. This. this <laughs> You've got to get ready for this one. This is more puns you'll ever hear in one sentence. This plain guy may pull some tricks and pine to the judge. You'll soon be sick of more of him. It's suddenly comics. <laughs> there you go. There's about five. Yay! Hi, <laughs> lady. Fantastic. And, and lastly, here's our judge. She's tremendous. It's Matilda <laughs> Tropica. There you go. That was a terrible pun. Never fear, Scotty is here. Lady fantastic. The sap and the saplings. Yeah. Hi, Mr. Steve Kyle. Spock. And easy, Hi, easy. The only way to be too. easy is when he's killed by death. Anyway, go on. Right, it's Captain Lumberjack to start off the show then. With his first yeah. tree. You gotta love how Captain Miss. Yeah, hey, I Carol, Cap I hope you're doing good. Well, I figured this one I better start off with because, you know, you can't talk about this guy without thinking about trees. So, Man thing or swamp thing? Oh, even better. Let's go with Tarzan. <laughs> <laughs> Loincloth. Well, he does go on trees a lot. That's true. That elephant's going to have a headache in the morning. Oh, look at that. Timber! Mm -hmm. I mean, that's one way to cut a tree uh, down, but it's going to result yeah. in elephants with headaches. Yep. Like Cap, he's a wheel swinger. <laughs> the original swinger. <laughs> uh, yeah, not bad, not bad. There's definitely a tree in there. Definitely a tree there. Oh, kind of oh I love your tree, Mr. Darren. It's very nice. An elephant as well. That's the first time you've ever heard that, I can assure you. <laughs> That's yeah. very pretty. I like that. If you like my yeah. tree, am I like your tree? Like <laughs> <laughs> that was good. That was good. Well, no. <laughs> not not much to see, I'm afraid. Probably not, but you have now, so <laughs> let's just <laughs> pretend you have it and move on to the score. <laughs> well, uh, you, you can see uh you can see my juke for all that counts. Oh, well, you got to see it again, do you, Gray Man? There it is. <laughs> Why am I on you? Oh, what happened there? Meant to be oh, on Matilda. <laughs> I know well, you missed me. We, right. uh, we said Darren said Bush, so he immediately went to Cap. It's logical. <laughs> <laughs> that's excuse me. I have a bit of a cold. Okay. That's a, that's a nice tree. You got some action around it, an elephant right in there. Very, very good. Nine. More than fair. <laughs> For a tired Tarzan. Nine. I'm waiting to see the Conan, which is a nice, just... healthy nine for Cap there. <laughs> All right, let's go to that little sapling down for his treats. first comic book. <laughs> <laughs> it's impossible. There are no trees on comics, so I've just come up with whatever I can. Well, uh, comics <laughs> are made of trees, so there you go. That's right. Can I just hold up some blank paper and say that's a no. tree? No, absolutely. <laughs> Back cover. You can try. I don't know if you a tree. <laughs> what do you ever do? Kicking off with the holiday scene from Lobo. Ah, crazy old Lobo. <laughs> He uh, says, hey, I'm the moon with a homicidal maniac. Mm -hmm. That's me, of course. 
Yeah. Yeah, you, you know whoever got That's that bottle, much. read that, put the no back in and threw it back in space. Yeah. Mm -hmm. <laughs> they probably telepath, heard of Lobo. Stuck with Lobo on a floating rock. How the bloody palm tree got onto that floating yeah, rock. How did the palm tree survive? It's yeah. Like, <laughs> I suppose it's just the I love how deserted on a tropical island meme isn't it really out of all the things going on with that cover is that the one <laughs> yeah, <know>? yeah. <laughs> well, that, i'm not going to say anything bad about the cover because that's one of my favorite series ever legion i really enjoyed that yeah. season uh, that series it's really fun so i'm not going to say anything bad about it but it, yeah i'll go no, to it logo hasn't destroyed the tree yet mm -hmm. yeah, exactly. no, that's destruction what color is that uh trade dress anyways matilda i didn't see Neither did I. I was focused on Lobo. So uh, might have been yellow. <laughs> you might want to ask to see that again. Uh, yeah. As yeah. long as I, I do like the cover of space. Eh? That looks like something out of uh, the Hitchhiker's Guide to the Galaxy. Right? Trees in space. Yeah. <laughs> Can a tree survive mm. without oxygen, though? Probably not. Why not? Well, carbon is Probably some kind of alien tree. Well, that sure. is. That is a very unique place for a tree. I'm not, not sure Lobo can one. survive without oxygen mm. either. Unfortunately, he can. I would say, <laughs> I would say that sp space, like Bill's parties, lacks atmosphere. <laughs> <laughs> uh, well, I'm giving this one a ten. Oh, <laughs> what? What? <Turkey. laughs> <laughs> if I were in space, you wouldn't be able to hear my cries of anger soon. <laughs> yeah. All right. I'd have in space, now I can hear you get five. five. I have a palm tree in space. Okay. <laughs> I, I give yeah. Lobo an hour before he takes down a coconut and makes a bra. True. Uh, here we go. Uh, it's a walking tree. It's a walking yeah, tree. Is that Groot? It's Groot. Uh, yes. Hey, I'm, Groot, you, Groot used yeah. to be chunky. Yeah, he did. He used to be quite chunky. He used to be a monster before he went. Where Groot walks. Well, what is he now? He's still a monster. He's just slimmer. <laughs> <laughs> and he's a monster. Yeah, he's just a kind of kind of he's Groot He also mm -hmm. can say, "Behold, I am Groot the Invisible, the Invincible. Who dares defy me?" Is he not very invincible, invincible yeah. Mister? I can Mark. see him. I can see him. I can see him right there. I, okay, so he can talk, right? So why in the movies did they have him just say, I am Groot? Yeah. Uh, it saves on the right. Why don't you just start a campfire, you know? Would that scare him away? <laughs> yeah, exactly. <laughs> probably. Yeah, go ahead and probably. Chainsaw chainsaw probably, uh, you've got their cap up uh, scare him a bit. But he's, uh, he's an alien, though, right? Yeah. So how would that work? How would, well, what, what, I don't know. How he's an alien tree, not like the palm tree from the last book. <laughs> well, this seedling had a seedling, and then they had a big old group after <laughs> yeah. that. Yeah, there's there's yeah, a bird exactly. and there's a bee. Like, like, this, there's a woodpecker in there. There must have been some rooting going on. <laughs> <laughs> nah, yeah, it's interesting how the how his alien race works. I mean, how they how they grow. By the way, that's a monster tree. Oh, yeah, trees are not monsters. Where that's is right. Phenomenon? Buildings, <laughs> whales, and trees aren't monsters. <laughs> a tree that grew sentient. A tree race. But yeah, grew is a sentient tree. It's kind of funny to see him chunky, though. But still, great. I'm giving that one a 10. Oh, uh, thank you. Okay, and I'm a big one. All right, then, Bill. Let's tree. see what you got, mate. All right. We have a Doug Wildey cover with issue number three of Johnny Quest Classics. May I recommend, Mr. Bill, wear a mask? Okay, there's some trees it there. looks like yes. you're a floating head. There's definitely <laughs> some trees in there. Yep. And we've got a very nervous dog. And little bandit. And I mean, white feather and gray one in the background. That's, they're sort of in the background, aren't they? They're like drawing kind of style. That's a fucking big dog. Yes. And they're in the. They're and in a scary, uh, is that a that lady or a man? That's a man. Oh, in Canada, it's hard to tell. Yeah. Right. Oh, look at that. Yeah, those are two different okay. art styles. That's a very a cool dog there. More trees on the back. Oh, nice. There are some trees there. 
Mm -hmm. Try as a wraparound, mate. You get more tree action then, didn't you? <laughs> yes. <laughs> Always. With both wraparound and dog, reach around, you always please. get more action. <laughs> the, dog, the dogs should look happier with all those trees. This thing knows all about the reach around. That's true. Well, I, I had to make a living in prison, you know. He says basically, <laughs> right. basically that cover is two dogs. Two dogs plus their toilet is basically all that is. It's like it's choice of tree to go against. Basically. You, really. no, I don't know. I think the wolf's probably dominating the peeing spots. <laughs> probably. Well, ben it's is a canine together, wrestling like, color. Mm -hmm. I'm fucked. But anyway, that is adorable and also a really cool concept. Ted. All right. Mm. And a lot of trees as well. Glad I warmed you guys right. up. I mean. Get my out the bag. <laughs> <laughs> Right, so this one, the tree is central, plus in the foreground, Death is drawing a picture of the tree as well Hi, as the guy leaning against it. So you can see the tree there, and the guy's guy leaning up against it after the end of a battle. All the dead are laying around him. He's drawing a picture, and here we see Death drawing a picture, which also mm. includes the tree in the picture. And so behind Death, the there's tree. another artist drawing Death, drawing the guy. Exactly. Yeah, he's. I can't. You can't really see what he's drawing, but your guy. Did you say? Yeah. But there you go. Well, weird war. It's, it's it nice looks, to know death that is home. Is it looks like he's drawing though, not drawing. That's that's where you miss me, sir. Yeah, drawing. <laughs> I'm not familiar with such. Not familiar well, with that. It's, it's, it's the, just uh, the same it's word, the but the you British say it wrong. Right, right. <laughs> Is that like it's drawing just, a bar? We invented that saying. Drawing a bar. We, we invented that saying, mate. So uh, what I say goes. <laughs> oh, oh, I yeah. still builds back to his Dick Van Dyke English. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, exactly. Hello, you all lucky. Very Poppins. Oh, never duck. <laughs> Mary Poppins, governor. <laughs> <laughs> you me up that chimney. Was Mary Poppins British? Yes, she was. The califragilisticexpialidocious, <laughs> even right. though the sound of it is sad, it's uncontrocious. <laughs> that, that is a fun movie. The original. Okay. Not, not Gray Man's interpretation. Uh, <laughs> yeah. uh, no, probably not. Dick Van Dyke's like 900 years old now. <laughs> Still got more brains than Bill. We call him <laughs> Gray Man Van Dyke, by the way. <laughs> it's synonymous. Only his friends do. do. <laughs> that, is, that is a fantastic cover and a great tree. I'm giving it a nine. More than fair. <laughs> yeah. I'm yeah. definitely. That's Okie dokie then. Let's go to the jury. Where is Jackson? Oh, oh yeah. You know what? Oh, Jackson I found you problems. Uh, yeah, he said he has uh, internet issues. He's got internet sad. issues. Every time he turns his computer we're, we're on, bills have... on it, he can't handle it anymore. <laughs> <laughs> uh, we're not going to have Jackson jokes. I'm uh, I'm already sad. Yeah. Right, Doyle. Doyle went on his first walk today. Ooh. He did. Uh, well, yeah. on, the, on the plus side, though, Matilda, there's no uh, there's no werewolf by lunchtime, so you won't get any farts today, probably. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, yeah, to take the take the small comforts. Okay, we got two votes for uh, you, Mr. Gray, one for Mr. Mark, and one for Darren. So currently, oh wait, uh, no, that's uh, that's a fake one. Right, I send you there. Then. <laughs> I'll send you one. Count when I'm not on, or what? Well, I counsel you not participating. Oh. Another one for you, Mr. Gray. Mr. O is here. Hi, Mr. O. Another oh, one for you, Mr. Cap. Oh, I appreciate it. I think Gray's got it, isn't he? I think yeah. so. Yeah, I think that's I think it, so. Mr. Not Gray. Much, I'm not too sure. much voting going on today. That's fine. That's fine. Cool. Okay, back to El Capitan for his next comic book. Well, this one I, I should have probably put a sexy lumberjack on the thumbnail. I just had to go with yeah. his eyes just said it all from being in a jungle, mm -hmm. an environment like that with trees yeah. and dinosaurs. I think we're going to have a lot of Tarzan today. Or 
Kazar. Yeah. He's got some weird eyes in it. Like he's some. Yeah, those eyes are weird. It looks like some kind of hybrid. And that's his pet gray man next to him. (laughs) (laughs) All 30 dinosaur. Cool. Hey, what the fuck? Does he have one boot on Uh, and another one? Mommy and a dinosaur. I wouldn't recommend it, Mr. Gray. No, he's barefoot, I believe. I think it's a leg yeah. band. You know, cavemen's always it's need true. that leg band for mm-hmm. accessories. Yeah, for the girdles. Yeah. Right. Climb he the keeps, tree. He keeps his keys in there, doesn't he? He keeps his keys. <laughs> his keys right. in his mobile phone and his fire, his fire <laughs> right. phone, whatever you want to call yep. it. <laughs> his wallet, his phone, and he his keys. He keeps his fit yeah. in there so he can get his step count up. Yeah, one. Just All that in the jungle. <laughs> just in case he runs into some good looking ladies. Mm-hmm. Right. Again, more uh, more good trees. Yeah. With the Kazar. Yeah. And they're a bit more in the background though, but still the eyes are wanky though. It's a weird but looking I, dinosaur. The dinosaur's the problem. I think Kazar's eyes are the problem. Yeah. Anyway, I'm giving that one a nine. More than fair. He had those uh, okay. that lazy eye, didn't he? Kazar did. No, nah, I just they're a weird shade. It almost yeah. look human. Blue eyes, right? One blue this way, one blue that way. Uh, <laughs> so he can blue the blue away. Speaking of a lazy eye. Darren, you're up, sir. <laughs> uh, speaking of blue things. <laughs> I could not find any comic covers with trees on. So uh, there's a Beatles album. You heard of the Beatles really? when they did the old LPs called like Abbey Road and they're crossing the street over a crossing. Mm-hmm. And if you look yeah. down the street, there yeah. are trees. Can I, can I use a cover cover to the uh, like a, a record, like vinyl? Yes, of yeah. course. Yeah. Only smart people have if done that like, in the mate. past one cover swingers. Oh, like damn it. Yeah. <laughs> This, which is a kind of humble <laughs> street. <laughs> uh-huh. <laughs> the <laughs> trick <goat. laughs> Now you're gonna start oh my. pulling records. There's definitely really. trees on that one. And Greatest of all yeah. time. You yeah. know that ghost is gonna shit everywhere. There's uh, trees on there, and one of Bill's <laughs> ex-partners. <laughs> I do mean the one. Which one? Front. Which one? The the woman, the man, or the goat? The goat. The one, the one in the front, Bill invites tablets every full moon. They, they dance naked <laughs> around the goat in the desert, around the cactuses and that. It's, it's, it's a regular, regular event. Yeah, you, you, you got it wrong, Mr. Gray. You dance naked around the... No, no, no. In the desert, they dance around the woodpecker naked. It has to be a lactating oh, yeah, goat with probably. an eye patch. Right. Well, the first time I've been called the goat, you know. But thanks for the comic book. <laughs> Billy Goat. All right, then. From one old goat to Matilda. Uh-huh. Great transition. Re- From the goat that. to the witch. Remember that. <laughs> okay, well, that, that, that is a funny uh, homage. Eh. Not that trees in the background, though. I don't know why his parents got him a pet goat. Bad mm. idea. Yeah. Anyway, I'm gonna give that one a nine. Woo! More than fair. Okie dokie, another nine. Another Let's nine. go okay. to Mark from Suddenly Comics. It's Forbidden Worlds with mm. the Warlock's Tree, Ooh. and the Warlock is getting his tree to attack Warlock's Nazi. Tree. Well, at least he's not showing his wood. Ooh! Yeah. So uh, oh, yeah. Go. Warlock's tree. The invisible yeah. warlock. We often have issues with Mark doing that on streams. <laughs> is, <laughs> is that not just a repeat of Groot? He showed Groot I, last last round. This is just like Groot. Like, I, I like how this wizard is dressed like he's in the medieval ages. What is with those pants? Groot is an what do you alien. Think you are, right? tree. <laughs> this is the tree being magicked by a warlock. Mm. A warlock who's dead. I yeah. take it because yeah. he's a ghost. <laughs> Even more interesting. Right, Haven't we seen the sentient trees tree. already, Matilda? Please keep that in mind. It's it's not the tree. <laughs> I'm very much bothered by his outfit. Yeah, it's me too. too. Mark, would you change, please? <laughs> oh, <I'm sorry. laughs> you, mean, you mean the character he's on the cover? Wearing, he's yeah. wearing a doublet and hose. The guy's invisible, Matilda. <laughs> I mean, he does look like a hoe. Fair enough. He's 
Mark or the comic book? No, <laughs> I wasn't quite sure. Was like, I got lost there for a minute. Uh, he, yep. he looks so funny. He's like a Shakespearean warlock. Just sees a skull. They're both wearing lederhosen. So who are we talking about? Right. <laughs> Maybe it's a ghost. <laughs> I mean, that, that is a funny tree. That has before green, right? That's yeah. still, that, that, that is a hilarious cover. Especially in that outfit. Ten. Oh, oh, Bill and his goats dance around the warlock tree at midnight. <laughs> and the what warlock also gets naked and joins them. Did I hear the You're uh, I, I didn't catch the score. I've got ten. so much lag today. I got the earmuffs on. I didn't hear that. Ten, yeah. yeah. I got ten. <laughs> I thought, I thought you said 10 from the... Uh, right, one of the of despair. Tell, Conan is coming. A Conan is coming. <laughs> I just... Uh, there is I one just of a killer, killer tree. No man thing. There is a killer tree on a Conan book. I thought. I, I thought man it. thing, but no. I didn't get one of uh, those. I want to see old Karen knows. But mm -hmm. we do have issue number 10. Bill's man thing was unimpressive, impressive. So he didn't want to show it. Of the Jungle Twin. Whoa. Oh. Jungle uh, twins, huh? Is that Tarzan's kids or what? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> that, that guy looks yeah. like a leopard, though. He's got him. The land yeah. where Tarzan. By the tail. Yeah, I'm glad Tarzan's wife survived giving birth to twins back like then. <laughs> Tono and Kono. It Every time I have a conversation with Darren, it feels like the time stopped. Well, <laughs> <laughs> I think Gold Key wanted to license Tarzan, couldn't get the license, so they came up with their own. Mm. It's, for all, the, it's for all the nice. horny women. That's why there's two of them. <laughs> really nice high-grade book, that one. Beautiful. Thank you, What's sir. What's better than Tarzan? Two Tarzan is basically what I'm thinking there. Yeah, it's and, like and twins. Nah, and right. twins. <laughs> well, well, Jane, Jane's all right, too. I, I bet you they're trying to get more women to read it. Could I'm be. Like, okay, what could draw it off? Oh, two of them. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Glad to know everyone's just as horny back Tarzan in the day. Tarzan twins. <laughs> yeah, the Tarzan twins. Uh, Anyway, that, that that was also great. I love all the, the, the trees around. That was some pretty cool. Ted. All right. Woo. And they're not wearing leopards. Okie dokie. Well Once. done. Neither one. Once or no leopard. Have you the nerve to face the unexpected? What beautiful flowers you grew. May I have one? Uh-oh. <laughs> I think the tree's about to have you, young lady. <laughs> dun, dun, not dun. in the way you hope. How unexpected. She can't have the flowers because the tree is going to have her. Ooh, what's going Not on? Not in the fun way either. Here. Mm -hmm. it's it's not not sinister figure. It's like, it's like Darren outside a stalker's house where he's, when he's going to visit ladies in the middle of the night. <laughs> Just a dark figure standing there with his lamp yeah, shut. You, you know her head's getting neat and clean off. Mm -hmm. Yeah. It doesn't look good for her. It's great art though. It's lovely no, art. It's going to uh, yeah. make a better oh. picture. You'll see, you'll see I ahead have a this course. The future is not going to be good. Mm. It's like she's pulled the head off that flower, probably, and the plant's going to pull the head off her. Something I mean, like it's that. only fair. Yeah, I think it's a plant, not a mm. tree, though, Gray Man. <laughs> no, I think it's a tree. Yeah. I think, well, yeah, I think, I think it looks like a tree, personally. It's got branches. I think it's some kind of exotic, like cacti type tree, or some kind of weird fern, or something like that. I think it's a magical shape tree. To the, the bark, or some shit like that. Yeah, and that's that what's well. fantastic. You know Maybe what would be just more sinister is if the tree's gonna grab her, and then that guy's gonna come over and do something. I, I guess at that point you might as well be killed off by the tree. But anyway, that one has fantastic card and awesome ten. <gasps> Thank you very much. I'm I'm flicking through it now to try and find out what kind of tree it is. <laughs> I think oh, it's yeah. some kind of magical I tree. Once more. Yeah, I, I think yeah, I you just magic the tree, tree to be. Yeah, he magic it to become I'm a monster. A tree that will f you up badly. <laughs> Trees are not <laughs> monsters. <laughs> exactly. Oh, thank you, Kyle. Well, 
in the world of the unexpected. In the world of the unexpected, sometimes they are monsters. <laughs> one vote for you, Mr. Gray. Uh, another one for you, Thank Mr. You Gray. Much. Thank you very much again. Oh, it throws good yeah, a guy up. leaves and you rigged the whole thing now, don't you, Gray Man? <laughs> another one for you. Oh, we got one vote for you, Mr. Mark. Oh, thank you, Cap. <laughs> and no, no, we got a real one. Uh, Mr. Yeah. But you're welcome, anyways. One, one for you, Mr. Darren. Woo! Beatles fan out there. <laughs> Yeah, Beatles fan who's never been to Liverpool. That looks nothing like Liverpool. The trees are fine. Yeah. Well, it looks nothing like the Beatles either. <laughs> I mean, they, they look better yeah. than the Beatles. At least they have a goat. Yeah. Well, some people some people do describe the Beatles as the goat, don't they? True. Or me. I don't or know. I saw, I saw a clip of John Lennon That's with Yoko Ono and it creeped me the fuck out. <laughs> All right. Who won that one? Who won that one? You I did. Scores goes to. I tied with you. I went to the other one. I went to the other from quite an upstairer, but I don't think it's enough, is it? Break off hey, you got another one, Mr. Mark. If only uh, Mr. Cat like wasn't four. participating, we'd Three, have a tie. No, no. One is oh, no, from, yeah, uh, yeah, yeah, Mr. yeah. One of them was one of yours was from. Yeah, yeah, yeah three, two. Okay, dope. All I'm right, then. Watch. Over to that no, unruly. Uh, round plus. three. Well, this comic, I'm going to go out on a limb here and try this one, but it is a tree. As long as it's a wooden limb. A tree limb? The tree of death. Ooh. I see I see. they couldn't be fucked with coloring. Yeah. <laughs> lazy, lazy, lazy. Hi, Todd. Good to see you. They've only got red left in the paint pot. And pink and purple. It's like the colors is like, you know what, screw it. They're all going to be red. Mm -hmm. And then now they're supposed to be some kind of concert. Centaurs, is it? Yep. Warriors yeah, is that that of Symbion, is it? Bars? Symbion? Yeah. Warriors of Symbion. No, that, that is a very suggestive I heard you've got some... <clears throat> Wasn't Sector written on your arrest record, Cap? <laughs> well, it was, but we can't discuss that right now. <laughs> Still got court case going on. <laughs> well, that is a nice thick tree, though. Sector in a built-up area. I love how the tea is, uh, <laughs> is a sword. All right, anyone tea. got anything to say about it? Lack, it's lacking color. It's lacking color. <laughs> we'll give it that. There's definitely a tree there, though. You can't doubt there's a tree. Maybe, maybe that was the idea the to make them stand out. In my world. Probably not. Red. Red, red still is a it nice can be. Out. Depends how you pronounce it, Scott. <laughs> but that that yeah. is a nice uh, nice tree, though. And the art is good, but again, they couldn't be fucked with the coloring. Yeah. But I'm going to give it a nine. Ugh. Yeah, Mark gets a bit confused about sex tours because he thinks of sex tours when he goes to Thailand to see the lady boys. But you know, it's easy to make, I suppose. Yeah, it makes me think of centers. <laughs> oh, right, Ben, back to the shiny blue tree. That's right. <laughs> so, um, this, <laughs> the following presentation may be the end of my cover slinger's career. Uh -oh. <laughs> oh, boy. So, it's all about Matilda, really, our lovely mm -hmm. Queen Matilda. Mm -hmm. Now, sometimes she throws around those tens willy-nilly, and sometimes uh -huh. she, she's putting eights and, you know, really bad scores on and giving us a hard time. I think it all depends how she gets out of bed in the morning. Today is tens liberally spread around. I think she had a good get out of bed in the morning today. Mm -hmm. But when she's on I an eight... I am feeling like shit. <laughs> when she's on an eight day, I think this is what Matilda looks like in the morning. Uh -oh. <laughs> oh. Yeah, I, I, I wish my hair was that organized. Was get him, Matilda, get him. And there is a thing. Right, at least I look fit. Oh, and now. I did always want bigger boobs. Matilda, is that, is that the jaguar, or as some people incorrectly say, the jaguar? <laughs> the jaguar, 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 jaguar. <laughs> exactly. I, I think it, she didn't last long. No. Hmm. Yeah, she kind of looks like She-Hulk from this angle. A little bit. 
Yeah, she's That's quite a cool character. Yeah, I wish I had that hair. You have got that hair when you let, you let your headphones off, Matilda. Just, just brush well, it I'm not one. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> I need some hair gel. <laughs> I've got here. You can like see all. You can see all this, the tree. The I've done tree. several uh, waterfall commercials with my. Right. <laughs> <Gosh, gosh. laughs> yeah, like, yeah. 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 waterfall. Right. right. <laughs> Mister Dan, do you have a house full of props? Like, and then like you this. steal them from your wife. <laughs> yeah, that's right. Oh, by, the <laughs> oh, by the way, was she angry and took all that tin foil? There is no wife. I'm waiting for no, the right he, woman to he walk into have a my wife. life. That's why he's ah. down on sex tours. Yeah. That's, <laughs> that's, 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 that. that, that's even more concerning than you have that shiny tree. Yes. <laughs> Matilda, that's why he was chatting you up with all that baloney. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I am not worthy of Queen Matilda. Silver tongue devil, that Darren. I Watch it. Here it comes. Ten. <laughs> <laughs> work for Atari. What the Tigra? Mm -hmm. Anyway, that, 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 that is a cool a, character. I'm trying to choke. I'm guessing that is a cool character, though. Make sure he's no more in the background. Could have, uh, but still, nine. Woohoo! Woo. <laughs> is Jaguar yeah, like nine for Jaguar? <laughs> Okay. Is it like a cougar? And he makes yeah. trees. We're going to have trees <laughs> in the background in a horror yeah. comic. It works for Grey. So um, here we go. Absolutely. Weird. There you go. Just like Where's Mr. Grey? Um, and we've got. Okay. Which one of them is Mr. Grey, though? Which well, one no, is Mr. Grey? Uh, which one of? Yeah. I'm going to say. I'm going to say it's the Grey one. The Grey one. Yeah. Yes. Oh, the lightest one at the bottom. That's Gray Man. Yeah. Yes. Mark, Mark's on top. Yeah. At least that's what I heard about him. And Darren's <laughs> in the middle. Yeah. Uh, only, when my, only when I'm on my sex tours. It's not a poultry tree there, mate. Like I say. And, and, and that's, that's, a, and that's supposed to be the, the three little pigs. I, I, can't, I, I can't work out if those are three little pigs or three big bad wolves. <laughs> I, th I think that's what happens when the when one of the pigs had sex with the wolf. They came out with this. Wait, did you say wolves instead of wolves, sir? Oh, that wasn't me. That was Matilda. Uh, yeah, no, that was Gray Man. That that does look like a pig made it with a werewolf. A I have never seen pig. Never seen a tree with a mustache before. <laughs> I have never seen such muscular pigs. You might have seen a tree with a mustache. You haven't lived, mate. <laughs> right. Has anyone has anyone has anyone got the idea that like Bill thinks that he's in uh, was it My Fair Lady or Pygmalion, where the elocution teacher teaches yeah. the rough East End girl? Is it, why does he keep trying to change my pronunciation of words? Has he got look some kind these, of weird fantasy? Where he, look at all these shelves. I'm going to speak like a proper person. I'm pretty sure well, I learned it goes from F to V when you pluralize it. <laughs> well, keep in mind, Mr. Gray, he is American. Uh, You're a Brit. We have a number of trees <laughs> and a number of wolves. Yes. Exactly. And a number of mustaches. <laughs> we have a wear pig. We have a wear pig. Wear pig. With very rare wear pig cover. <laughs> At least now we know what happens if a werewolf has sex with a pig. Yeah, a, one you. mystery solved. Mm -hmm. well, what are we talking cool about, Bill again? Forest, though. True. Yeah, we, I wish the trees were closer, but still, just those were pigs, Ted. Oh, oh yes. Woo. Where did pigs get a 10? Oh, yes, they do. They were pigs. They were, anyway. That means they're kosher. I think. <laughs> that would <what> mean? Not to be confused with war pigs. <laughs> no, were right. pigs. We've got issue number four. Of Frank Rosetta's death dealer. I gotta, I gotta find a rabbi and ask him if we can eat dogs. You can't eat these ones. I wouldn't eat those dogs, but I'd eat that woman. <laughs> <laughs> well, I guess you wait after she tucks her child. Very, to very slowly. 
<laughs> yes, I can see she's holding a cute ginger baby. But we do uh, have plenty I, of trees. Be careful! Be careful if uh, be careful if Darren asks you around for dinner. He tells you he's having rump steak. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. uh, that's a shame. You can't. If, if he uh, says, actually, not a shame. But now we know. If he says cold. dinner on me, and he's and you get there, and he's covered in like food, then you know you know you're in trouble. <laughs> Was that Ed Sheeran's love child on that cover then? <laughs> no, it's uh, that kid is far too cute, and that woman is too hot. No offense to Ed Sheeran. Is that exactly? Uh... She can't be that hot with all the snow around her. <laughs> well, you know she's freezing her feet off, by the way, and her ass. It's a good thing she had a kid. I don't think she's gonna have another one. <laughs> and after everything freezes down below. Mm -hmm. Oh, oh, free egg freezing. <laughs> the old style. I have to chip the ice off. That's probably anyway. what's going on in her head. <laughs> well, she's gonna die anyway, so it doesn't matter. All right, I'm giving that one a ten. That art is fantastic and has a great ass. Right, I can't decide which one of these two covers to show. I'm gonna Everyone go with this one because it's got it's got a bit more going on for it. So here we go, swamp thing. We've got trees in the background, we've got elephants, we've got Big tree there. Oh, look, and there's the, the very Stargarian. All grown mm. up. And, uh, now, this is. Uh, oh, I know that was this a joke. The of Alec Holland. Teffy. Teffy, her name is. Where's Swamp uh, Thing? Probably pronounced it wrong. We'll have to ask Bill. We'll have to ask the educator of execution <laughs> how to pronounce her name. But yeah, no, where's where where Swamp Thing? It. Oh, if, if it was in English, you'd be mispronouncing it. <laughs> Brutals. Exactly. Brutals. Exactly. <laughs> but where is Swamp Thing? Good question. That she is the Swamp Thing. She's Swamp Thing's daughter. She is the Swamp Thing in, in this run. She's Tefe Holland. She's the daughter of um Abigail Arcane. I, I take it he appropriated before becoming Swamp Thing, yes? Yes. No, he didn't. No, he did not. No. He took on he, he entered the body of um oh who's the bloody <laughs> oh, here we go. Uh, oh fucking what was the bloody the wizard is this? Um, yeah, Hellblazer. You know, the guy, uh, Constantine. Constantine. He the body of Con John Constantine and uh, impregnated her with some magic. No, she's Constantine's daughter. Uh, um, elemental method. No, so she's not. He, I can't remember how it's described in the comic book, but it's... No, she, he well, used uh, her, Mr. his Darren, body, but somehow he, he... I don't know what's coming out. You have to read it yourself, but uh, it has swamp thing she's got DNA, elemental powers like swamp. DNA. So there's, I also yeah, think I she has some interesting was, parts down, down below. Bill has done a DNA analysis. It's it was an interesting <laughs> surrogate uh, <laughs> arrangement. She was on 23 and Me, and everything pointed to uh, swamp thing. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> uh, I'm, I'm scared to know what's down below, if you know what I mean. <laughs> Maury Povich said, Constantine, you are not the father. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I, I guess. Well, what technically guess, would be the father? I guess she's like all women, Matilda. There's a bush down below. I, I mean, Constantine would technically be the father, right? Because all the old swamp thing just used his body and his sperm, essentially. Yeah, That's I can't remember weird. how it was done in the comic book, but it's his, his, his daughter. I can't remember exactly what the description of it was. I mean, yeah. if he actually that Just concentrate on the lovely trees and the elephants. <laughs> I'm thinking maybe he and the uh, green uh, poison ivy should mate. Oh, I wonder what kind of kid. Green. By the way, you're... yeah, definitely. And some weird genitals. Mm -hmm. Anyway, I'm going to give this one uh, a nine. It's nice, but the, the tree could have been bigger. Yeah, he hears that a lot, by the way. That's what she said. I always okay. want bigger wood. <laughs> Just hanging in the bush. No, 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 we don't know how old she is. Well, she's underage. There's a very nice tree I there in the front, you know, that's beside her. There's lovely trees. Yeah, yeah, the but it's a big, 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 big,
But she is pretty. It could have been more. Well, the skinny little trees that, that, uh, that Mark's got on his combo got a 10. You All can right, barely we see. Got... <laughs> we got three votes for Mr. Bill. We got one for you, Mr. Mark. Thanks, Dad. And uh, one for you, Thanks, Kel. Daddy. No, it's Bill. Now there one, uh, one for you, Mr. Gray. Easy comic reader, thank you. So with uh, so far, Mr. Bill's in the lead. Oh, uh, Mr. Mark, you got another vote. Thank you, Ranger Sly. That kind of you. I don't think it's gonna help though. I think <laughs> Bill is gonna win because he showed a bottom. <laughs> well, it is a very nice bottom. I mean, Mr. Darren wants to eat it. Well, I'd have eat, I didn't want to eat the elephants either on Grace cover, but I'd have eaten that woman as well. <laughs> yeah. All right, Mr. Bill, you get the extra That, that, means, that right. means nothing. Look at the size of Darren, nearly anything. Um, here's the other one I didn't show. There's a massive tree in it. I thought about maybe showing that one instead. That, that would have been anyway, better. That's over a good to one. Cap for his... Making me hungry. All right, fourth <laughs> round. Well, this one I... I figured maybe I should use it, maybe I shouldn't, but then I saw the back cover and it was just as cool as the front. So let's go with a little X Men in the oh. jungle. Big old purple dinosaur tied up to a tree. Oh, yeah. I got it. Is that a wraparound? Is that a different picture? It's a different picture, it's not a wraparound, is it? Uh, it makes a lot of sense to have a mohawk in the forest. So it it a wraparound? No, I mean, it's just a different picture. It's not it's a tree on the front cover. Well, it's, it's a great cover, though. You can see some darkness on the tree. Yeah, we don't need to see the front or back cover. It's not back cover. Just imagine week. wasting time in the, in the jungle to get a mohawk. Scott's right. That's Barney on the back. Oh, oh that's there Barney when so cool. <laughs> Barney the dinosaur. Mm. I will say it looks way less it creepy. Right color. <laughs> and well, he's way less Barney, creepy. but <laughs> <laughs> I certainly well, hope so. Uh, cat, not back cover. There's front cover. Trees on both sides. Well, technically, yeah, there are trees tree there, there still. Where's the tree? There are branches on I the know, front. It's... In Cap's defense, there's some branches like maybe. Uh, like you can just about see behind the X-Men logo. Oh, I Actually, there's some trunks as well. I'm going to more involved see. except here. Could be the... Could be the... Um, oh, okay. yeah, the trunk of the tree, right. maybe. Anyway. That is the trunk oh, of the jungle. tree. That is still a very big tree and a very cool dinosaur. Mm. Yeah, yeah, but the dinosaur's the back cover. Raptor. It's not a raptor. Yeah. Yeah. Not counting the I'm back cover, I'm are we? I'm pretty sure it is a wraparound because it's like she got one so, side and the other. On either side. Have it, hold, it up as the, hold it up as the full thing, uh, Cap. The, the uh, yeah, it's thing. not a wraparound. No, I don't think I it can't. was. No. But this kind is, of does look like the, it, the same person who, who erroneously gives my covers nines also thinks that's a wraparound. <laughs> <laughs> we need to on both sides, we though. Need you know, that's the thing. Yeah, we, we, do, we do have trees in the back still. On the uh, on classic X Men. On classic X Men. That is a cool uh, cover and some X Men. So I'm yeah. giving that a nine. They yeah. often used to put a pin up on the back cover, and so it was like two different artists: the front cover and then a pin up on the back cover. Uh, it's hard to know. Back in the day, they used to get more out of the covers. I just well, get the okay, same then. varying different colors. Let's go to well, Tarzan Darren. I'm sorry, Gray, if this one's already on yours, but I've got to use it. It's so cool. Oh, no, you're fine. Oh, yeah, no, you're good. You're good. I didn't, I didn't I put them back in the end. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Look yeah, up. it's a big old okay. tree there. Look Finding up, look up. The <laughs> Fun issue, says uh, Scotty. Has Matilda gone to sleep? Oh, she's she's disappeared. Your cover's that bad, Darren. Oh, yeah, man. I'm trying to well, I knew something was wrong she's because it off. wasn't getting slated. <laughs> <laughs> she's, I'm back. She's, she's got off and fetched her glasses so she can see the covers properly. Yeah, she oh, had to bomb it. She oh, had to bomb it. I had to blow my nose for fuck's oh, sake. <laughs> yeah, that's what I meant. <laughs> yeah. I yeah, already went it. out for blood earlier. All right, now, now she's. 
blown her nose. We all know what she's up to. But anyway, let's uh, let's go to the oh, get them breaks. <laughs> oh, now, come now on, she's Mr. Her Ray. Nose. <laughs> Cocaine doesn't work on me anymore. <laughs> 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 all right, that that is the or any thing. less yeah. or what, Matilda? Yeah, is that a chick on top there? Hard to no. Yeah, yeah. Late, it's like a lady <laughs> green arrow in a red costume, so she's not green at all. Mm, arrow, awful. where her name is. <laughs> well, there's a nice big tree and a very cool scene. They mm. might get a arrow, arrow in between the eyes. I'm giving that one a ten. Oh, oh yeah. Well, what can I see? You, know? you can't mate. complain after your last one got a ten mark. Come on now. <laughs> <laughs> That was a Bernie Wrightson horror cover. Was it really? It wasn't his greatest work, was it? No, <laughs> not. Not really good. We've got Tarzan. Uh, we got oh my God, she cheated! Yeah. Here we see young Mark. Man, <laughs> 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 uh, evolution went bad for these two, eh? The child I, I, turned out a monkey. <laughs> I've got I to read that's you. a tree. That's a pot plant. Hang on, guys. That is a pot plant in the background. I have to read you the inside pack. This is just so great. This is from what year is this? Must be in the 50s. It, it's called Tomboys. This is the editorial. Most school schoolgirls like to join adventurous games with their brothers. And why not? Although they are often labelled tomboys, I find that they mostly grow into perfectly good feminine women eventually. He's <laughs> <laughs> never met a lesbian, I take it. No, I don't, I don't think they admitted they existed when this comic came out. <laughs> good point. I like how he's copping a feel on the monkey, but has a knife on the woman. Right. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Watch out for that, Jane. Cheat us all. Right. right. Wow, it looks to me like Tarzan. It looks to and me like Tarzan. Look, 6D. Tarzan can't make up his mind in that picture. Who wants to go to bed with? Oh, for fuck's sake, that monkey's probably a child. Well, he's not interested in her. She's the tomboy. Clearly, <laughs> Clearly you can see that. Oh, that editorial is hilarious, though. I, mean, I, I don't think that's a tree in the head. background. That looks like a pop plant to me. It's a pop yeah. tree. That looks like a pop plant that was put closer to the camera. Yeah. I, I know why he's holding no, the knife. He's still suspicious she cheated on him. <laughs> and just look at the kid, right? Yeah. It's like, well, why, why, why does he look yeah. like that? Oh, he's just hairy, dear. No, he's not. Cheat is the monkey's name, Matilda, so I don't know where you're going with that. Yeah. Cheat <laughs> is the monkey's name. Uh, that, that is cute, though. Man. It's like a family photo with their uh, monkey pet. Mm -hmm. But yeah, but not so much trees, but still. That still has a cool color. <laughs> Editorial is funny, though. Interesting to show this, uh, whoever wrote in the, the future. Probably be horrified to be fair. They would be horrified, yes. Probably, yep. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Very horrified. <laughs> I mean, I agree. Anyway, nine. Thank you. Yeah. Okie dokie. Still very lovely, aren't so From one tomboy to another. <laughs> uh, well, from one tomboy to another. I think, I think he will grow up to be a, a lovely young lady as well. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, oh, yeah. Darren. Very you know. <laughs> sweet of you to say. All right. Uh, we have a Richard <laughs> Courtney cover with issue 142 of Gray Man. I mean, uh, <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I don't think that Dinosaurs dinosaur is going to be able to cross. Uh, that tree is not no. going to hold up to that dinosaur trying to cross on yeah, it. Yeah, I don't think so. No. No, but it's going to no. create a hilarious Looney Tunes. Sure yeah, the other ones are like, Shh, don't say anything. Don't say anything to them. You know, they want to see it happen. <laughs> one, of them's, one of them's got his, cam, cool. his his phone out, his iPhone out. He's getting ready to film it. Yeah, it's yeah, in prehistoric times. Yes, it's a shame it's not Dinosaur Week, really. I think <laughs> Cap, Cap, Cap and Bob have seemed to got yeah, the right. dinosaurs on this tree <laughs> thing. Uh, week. I mean, that art is fantastic. Okay. Though. Surely, a fallen tree is a log. 
Ah, you got some yeah. trees in the like, background. You see one, two, three. <laughs> there are some trees on the side there. Some very small trees. It's more mountains oh, come than on. dinosaurs. It's, it's not the trees, size, really, Mr. Grace. Kind of... What do you do with it? <laughs> <laughs> oh, there there are there are the way in the wind, I'm pretty sure on my last comic book you mentioned the size of the trees. You not count all of a sudden the size of the trees. <laughs> yeah. oh, that's it that's always convenient. counts, Greg. Yeah, it always always in the last round, for some re- <laughs> selective memory, Matilda. Isn't it? Uh, can anyone say racist? I certainly can. <laughs> Hi, Kenneth. Well, anyway, the, the art on that is spectacular. Ten. All right. Woo. For for a log. <laughs> Ten for a long yeah, you know, <laughs> yeah, see, yeah, I'm firing a toothpick excellent, in there. Uh, as soon as I'm creeping. It's a dinosaur week. Hey, Kenneth. Oh, look, it's Poppy. Yeah. Hi, right. Poppy. As soon as I'm creepy, I'm going with another... Poppy also agrees <laughs> with creepy. <laughs> <laughs> right. No, low grade, but it's another tree attacking a human on the cover of Phantom Stranger. Oh. You have a weird fetish, Mr. Gray. Mm-hmm. That's, that's <laughs> low grade, isn't it? I don't draw them, Matilda. I don't draw them. I just pick them out for the show. Are you sure? No, I don't pick They both them. happen to be in the same box. Right? Oh. I don't think it's fair to call um, them low grade, grade, Bill. <laughs> <laughs> I still, yeah, yeah, I'm cheap and low grade. Cheap. I'm a cheap Holy date. Shit. That's one of your highest grade comics, Gray. <laughs> that is, that is. That I looks need like more points. To on it. On my grade. It's 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 been well read, Matilda. Like you know, like a comic should be. Yeah, no shit. And then used as an S cover. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Yep. It's got it's got more lines and caps forehead. <laughs> <laughs> no, I can't keep up with me. But not as many as my nuts. So more lines and catch four. <laughs> <than my invisible. laughs> yeah. Okay. Do they have lines on them? <laughs> and you just say the autonomy at school, unfortunately. That Darren will send you a picture later, Matilda. <laughs> okay, I'm good. I, I don't need to know. Just to <laughs> Actually, I probably <laughs> should. So look at a look at a biology <laughs> book after. <laughs> All right, that, that, that is a, another cool magical tree. Yeah. It's got Phantom Stranger, you know some shit's going to go down. Mm-hmm. It's still Purple. very cool. Purple there. Ten. Ten. Oh! Okay. She really uh, got out of the bed uh, right side this morning with all right. these tens. <laughs> And someone with a rent kick Joe out of chat, please. He's in no. time out, I think, <laughs> after, after no. that comment. Uh, Joey bag of sevens, and he was right. Someone give him no, a time I'm now. No, thank you, Mr. Kyle. I'm good. Right. There's a the reason the Over sexy the pictures are always in underwear. You don't need to see the junk. Yeah, she wants trees. I, I know this is low grade, but I'm pretty sure a piece of it just fell off. I saw something falling on the ground. I think I think something just fell out of it. Probably a bit of a. Well, as you said, it's been well read. One for you, Mr. Gray. Yeah. Uh, one for Mr. Darren. One for you, Mr. Bill. Another one for you, Mr. Gray. Another one for Mr. Gray. Mr. Gray, you have four. Oh, one for Ooh. you, Cap. A pity vote for you, Mr. Darren, from Cap. Needed pity, needed. <laughs> Man, Huskies are cheap. Okay, I think that's all the votes we're going to get, is it? I think Gray Man got it. Yep, I, I think that's it. Awesome. Thank you. Thank you, jury. Creepy trees are cool. You're very, you're very correct, sir. You're very correct. Okay, it's the last round, everybody. Let's go to Jolly Old Lumberjack Cap. His last comic book. Well, I keep uh, getting this bush in my way. So from Darren, I need to chop that bush down from Darren. <laughs> <laughs> Hang on a sec. I, yeah, actually, that that is how they uh, trim the bush in some uh, scary movie. Sorry, Darren. I trimmed the bush like too that. much. Uh, I'll work harder next time. All right. Oh, <laughs> Not very good with chainsaw. Well, my that, cover that, here. That is extreme uh, trimmings. Yeah. Mm-hmm. But there was a scene like that in scary movie, right? 
Well, you got to always check in the bush because you never know. It might be a rattler in there. <laughs> oh, God. Oh, uh, yeah. In that case, you should go see a fucking doctor. Gosh. There's always a snake in a bush. <laughs> yeah. I hope not. For your sake, gentlemen. I mean, you want to see a cave behind the bush. I mean. Old scalp hunters in trouble there. Yeah. Well, Bullets in front of him, poisonous, I say venomous snakes next to him. I think in well, cap I, case, I think problem solved. Just grab the snake, throw it in the soil. We got trees. That's that's what it's about, right? Matilda in yeah. Cap's case, it's a worm in a you bush, might have but it's the same concept. <laughs> I, I was going to say, it's blushing really hard, yeah. but that's war paint, isn't it? Mm -hmm. well, speaking of yeah. trees... My little tree mm. peer woke up. Oh, da dad woke up? Okay. No. <laughs> Doyle woke up. Oh, okay. Actually, where, where, is, your, is your dad out? Because there's no TV in the background. I can't hear any TV in the background today. No, I just made it quieter. Do you tell him you won't stand ah. for that TV to be loud this <laughs> time? <laughs> 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 Hey, don't worry. If it gets loud, I'll just turn off the mic. All right. No, uh, I haven't heard one... it today. I was saying I haven't heard it today. Normally we hear it. Nah, that, that just made it quieter. All right, but that that one is fantastic. Yeah. We got action. We got bushes and snakes and trees. Ten. Oh. Woo. Well, okay. Yeah. And also that uh, how we trip that demonstration. Is that how you okay. help Tori, Mister Cap? Oh yeah, same way. <laughs> Trim your bush. Doing <laughs> me. Yeah, we needed the right, garden, then. of course. Well, I think as usual, I'm propping up the bottom of the scoring. So at this point, I don't know what to do. I don't know what to say. Is that Where tree attached to your back? With some palm trees on it. I think it is. Ooh, <laughs> some more palm trees. A big palm tree all the way to the top, and there's the little leaves in there as well. Yeah. How long did they you to If you had the one, the three together, <laughs> that's his score. <laughs> 13, yeah. Well, ladies, don't drink all the water. <laughs> but at least there's some hot babies for me to think about eating. <laughs> yes, they're good. <laughs> okay. Right, I think you might want to get them rescued uh, and into a shower okay, first. That's no good, Darren. It hasn't got any dinosaurs on it. <laughs> you, you don't want a bush with yeah. sand in it. No, not at all. And it's not in space either. It's not in, it's space, not in space. It hasn't got any dinosaurs. And a local must be around somewhere gathering coconuts. No good. You're better than that, Darren. <laughs> no dinosaurs. No space. No logo. <laughs> I've never seen a Gen 13 cover like that. And they're usually uh, even sexier. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that they're more dressed. And, and yeah. longer. Well, they're just more dressed. Yeah. But <laughs> yeah. well, those are two nice palm trees. I'll give you that. <laughs> well, it's just I'll... less sexy because Darren's holding it. <laughs> <laughs> well, I'll, I'll give that one a nine. Oh. Woo. Oh, my throat's going to kill me at the end of this. Okie dokie. All right, then. Let's go to Tim. Oh, we, we need Pamela Anderson to run <laughs> in the background. A young her. Pamela Anderson. It's an old green dog. thing. The green thing. Yeah. Huh. yeah that's uh, Groot's that's cousin, the, the green retarded thing. one. Yes, it, this is but correct. It is enough Groot's about what's hanging from Matilda's nose. <laughs> <laughs> they, they gave up with naming things at this point, Matilda. <laughs> Very yeah, imaginative name. I mean, it looks like he has a brain tumor. No, no, that's a great. Well, let, let's leave Mark out of this. Let's concentrate on the. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Trees so, are not well, monsters. Yeah. Isn't that broccoli? It does kind of look like a broccoli. Green yeah. things aren't monsters. That's right. Yeah. Yeah. Don't, oh, don't. look, he has little babies. That's There's little baby ones as well. Look. <laughs> yeah. Bill showed his well, green thing to the doctor and got some antibiotics. <laughs> <laughs> and was told not to, not to pick on the woodpecker anymore after that. Yeah, that's not to touch it. Awesome hey, monster. woodpecker picks on me. What are you talking about? Awesome monster cover, but where are the trees? 
Yeah. Oh, the trees. <laughs> I think he's it alluding to the green thing being a tree, Darren. Oh. I can't believe we Quite did have the man thing today. It's got branches. Well, I'm the right here, girl. But, I'm the man. Well, I, I, I would like to say, <laughs> like to say that is definitely a plant. It's definitely a plant life being, yeah. A plant being. <laughs> well, I think it's more broccoli than tree. No. It's more broccoli than tree. That's how broccoli I can be. <laughs> if you open it up, it's the, the, the broccoli that walks like a man, it says inside. <laughs> Hang on a minute. Your tree that didn't look like a tree. You just said. <laughs> <Right. laughs> yeah, I mean, it is tree like, Mr. Gray. The puppies agree with me. Broccoli yeah. stalks are not monsters. Matilda. Good puppy. <laughs> it's, it's tree like in the same way that dogs like trees. <laughs> no, I think it's still a tree. It's just Groot's retarded cousin. Yes, well said. With the brain tumor. Quick and folk, yeah. that is from a creative. I'll give you a 10. Oh, thank you. Oh, wow. A no tree cover. Oh, my God. Oh, wow. It is a tree. It's a tree. Oh, and one of my stunts there, I tell you. Uh, your, your cover had two Grotty palm trees. He was just talking about the girls. That's not even a tree. It's a broccoli stalk. If ever I saw one. All right. Oh boy. All right. That broccoli stalk. I did think about the one I have a friend to another. The box. I'm not going to even say it. Um. Well, well, I was going to say, I was thinking about getting into the box of the man <laughs> thing, but it's uh, too many things going on there. So, no, no man thing yeah. comics for me today. But we I am very disappointed right now. <laughs> we have issue 73. Oh, I'm going to dive into it. Okay, okay. Okay, you're forgiven. There's Conan. Conan is always playing, always playing with his snake. <laughs> I mean, uh, we had a snake cover on this week's show. I don't uh, think a lot of ladies mind when he plays with the snake. <laughs> Old man plays with the snake. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Bill's man thing seldom gets into a box. It's it's spitting at him. It is that snake. Is that how to train yeah. your snake or what? I bet you that's a female snake. Yeah, she wants a piece of Conan too. Can't Could blame be. him. Could be. That's very nice. That is fantastic that's, art. Yeah. And a nice dirty tree that's, behind that's you, too. That's part of yeah. Bill's homoerotic collection. <laughs> 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 what do you mean, part of it? What's uh, up, Kara? Uh, was that a poppy? Meowing? Well, anyway, I'm giving that one a 10. At least some oh, sexy right. Conan. <laughs> Hi, Perry. Well, I couldn't resist showing this one. It's kind of a tree. One of the characters like actually some mentioned a tree. So here we go. Ay! I've lost Superman. He's turning into a tree. Because <laughs> <laughs> oh, he's, he's assuredly turning into a you tree. You know, because the meal always going to hear low stuff like Mr. Gray. Mm-hmm. Yeah. It's gonna Only, be fucking it's really certainly tree-like, and she does mention a tree. So although it's he's not fully a tree, it's definitely tree themed because he's turning into a tree and she says well, the word tree. And I I my my I just point out a comment from Scotty, a very intelligent member of the jury here. <laughs> yeah. Uh just want to point that out. Well, a very you erudite got, you and intelligent and pretty of member of the He's just after his wood. That's it. Uh, <laughs> sorry, but that is not a he tree. That is a Aye, but... He's turning into a tree. <laughs> that is <laughs> Man of Steel. <laughs> Look at that seventies. That sexy little seventies suit that, that um, and it's in Matilda that Lois is wearing. There. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he's a little brown nose yeah, in there. This was great in the seventies. That's if, right, Scott. Uh, all I can say, fellas, if Lois's thighs don't turn you into a bit of a tree, then then what can I say? Right, but great. My comment here is: this is not a tree cover. 
This is Superman turning into a tree, but he hasn't turned into I a tree. I hear your comment. He hasn't turned into a tree. Therefore, he I just, can I just counter that? I, I, I understand and hear your comment, Mark. And I say to that... <laughs> You can there. always tell when you're winning an argument because the opponent just <laughs> goes. This is not a piece of broccoli. Here you go. Oh, oh that's great. Matilda loves that cover so much. She, she's trying to. She's checking the rules. See if she can give it a twenty. She's like, Maybe I can give it twenty. This is called Grey Man, the winner, and not worry about the jury vote. Bullshit. Don't, doing. don't even fucking think about it. I'm bad. Anyway, man, man's always a bit wooden. Maybe yeah, she just well, looked up new face, yeah. words in her dictionary. Uh, well, mm -hmm. I have too many. Okay, I mean, yeah, he's he's somewhat turned into a tree. His limbs are halfway there. Mm -hmm. He, he I mean, is turning into a tree. I'll give you that. He's turning into a tree, but he's not a tree. Right. He's not fully a tree. No, mm -hmm. but the when thing is, trees. He's turning into a tree, and he mentions trees. Okay, so but I he's not. He's not fully a tree. His right. limbs. He's still he's getting he's there. Not. You are very correct. You are very he's correct. Right. But he matches the theme. <laughs> Okay. Yeah, when but the theme is trees. Tree, perfectly matches the tree theme. <laughs> <laughs> right. Well, when, when, when he has it, it's a nice tree. cover, but it's not fully a tree. But Lois mm. does look great, so I'll He's give not. you an eight. He's not. You're very true. Oh, fair. But when he has turned into a tree, is his also ego dark eight. Kent? Yes. Okay. Yeah, probably. Eight. And then Lois will want to marry him. Eight. Oh, right. okay. oh, then. I mean, well, he's not a tree. One. You are correct, but he's not a tree. Look, it matches the theme of trees perfectly. He's not a tree, but the theme is okay, trees. He's turned into get, a tree. That okay, matches the theme perfectly. Down for no full tree turning. I think you were very generous there, Matilda, with no trees. <laughs> no, I think she was gracious as always. In fact, I'm going to play the video because it's, uh, right, it's definitely... Yeah, uh... Matilda, don't be so gracious. That cover was a 10 and you know it. Oh, fuck <laughs> off, Joker. Go back. <laughs> I, don't I, feel so right. about, I don't feel so wait, bad about my got... palm trees now. Wait, wait, wait. Okay, we got... Oh, we got four votes for you, Mr. Gray. One for Mr. Darren. Once again, the jury makes up the judge's failings. Two for Mr. Cap. The jury does. Oh, one for Mr. Darren. Lack of education and. Lack of understanding when one is a tree. Come on, he matches the tree perfectly. He's turned into a tree. How can he not be matching the tree? But he's not a tree. He's not a tree. He's turned into a tree, but he's not a fucking tree. Wait a minute. That matches the theme. The are there any? Trees. Are there any uh, into leaf? a tree? How is that not matching the theme in anybody's world but yours, Matilda? These How many nimble steels on all sides doesn't match the theme. You won't need to lose points, but you got those got got branches. Oh, that tree, no, really. Really. Oh, for fuck's sake! Why do you care? You won this week anyway. Now let me do score. <laughs> oh, I think. Oh, I'm thanks for revealing exactly, it already. That's, that's not. That's despite you, Matilda, not because of you, despite <laughs> you and the nines and eights that you've given me. Honestly, your gracism is shocking. Absolutely shocking. I might not have won because all the eights and nines you've given me, I don't know yet. <laughs> it's nothing to do with IQ, okay. it's to do with common anyway, sense and understanding of the um, natural world. Superman is not a tree. Yeah, he's turning into a tree. It turning into the one, he's not one. Right. Yeah, but it's trees. He's turning into a tree. That's the theme. Oh, the theme is trees. trees. He's turning into a tree. He's not actually a tree yet, but it still matches the theme because he's going to turn into a tree. Oh, he's about to turn into a tree. Well, he's currently he's not a, a fucking tree. He wouldn't match the theme. But he's turning into a tree. So it matches the theme. <laughs> I've seen him recently. He doesn't look very tree like to me. Oh, uh, uh, well. Is it he time looks... for some reserves? Yeah, if you want yeah. to set some backups. 
I've got lots, so <laughs> have at it, Darren. I'm going rapid fire, and as soon as you're bored, you can cut me off. Okay, it's one thing, oh, right? Good one. Loads of palm trees, action there you cover. Go. Yep. Black panther with a tree and a cap. Representation of a tree through a stained glass window. It is oh, a stained glass good. window. Oh, okay. This one I really wanted to show. Garden of Eden, apples. But that's not a tree. That's a stained yeah. glass window. <laughs> that's true. <laughs> <laughs> apples grow on trees, so that's a tiny little tree. Just yeah. as well he didn't show it then. You're on the table. <laughs> Palm trees with grew. Yeah. Background trees. More background trees. More background trees. Oh, here's a good one. Swamp thing being over in amongst trees. Terrible cover. Absolutely terrible cover. But there's some trees being flown over and around. Oh, I want that one. Spidey, please on pretty much the same run. Nearly I was going to use that. Oh, yes. Avengers in a field of trees. Mm. Oh, trees. Yeah. More trees. Uh-huh. Silly, tiny little tree. I'm but, oh, is that a Sandman comic? <laughs> Some nope. trees, McFarlane. Yeah. Uh, ugly, ugly Hulk. Yes. Yes. Your favorite Hulk. Hulk. Christmas trees. Oh. Oh. I'm done. Yeah. <laughs> oh, I want to use That's that one. one. Save that one for Darren. Christmas. One of the first comics I bought. Mr. Freeze. That would have been a good tree on the cover. Yeah, that it she's, a good one. she's a tree by name. Yeah, for sure. No, that would not count. No, not count. Yeah, I was say the children. The children wouldn't know that. Depends who showed it, really. If Cap showed it, it would be fine. If I showed it, yeah, I would have no, it. Still, I still wouldn't have counted. Or I think I have a Christmas mystery like, comic. That would have been. Oh, good. oh, that'd be good. Yeah, I just didn't think to look for that. It's very down there, all the Conan snakes. Are uh, you I'm ready to the children? Yeah, I'm ready. We know who's won great. He <laughs> already told us who's going to win. Yeah, he, he's all excited this time, isn't he? Are you? Right. Yeah, nobody is complaining. <laughs> oh, dear. Oh, you're sure a lot of fun. Uh, now, apparently, the judge's decision is final now that Gray's got the points. <laughs> <laughs> oh, naturally. Okay, ready, gentlemen. Come that on. Comes up every week. We're, talking talking about. We're ready. <laughs> Mr. Gray's not ready. Okay. Children is sick because I might have won this week. Like, let her get it over with. <laughs> oh, get over yourself. I didn't get your call because of your <laughs> bullshit. Okay. Fifth place this week with 46 points is Mr. Cap. Still hold my well title. Done. No, well, well, done, well done, sir. Well done. Hold my <laughs> title. Tell your children. <laughs> <laughs> All right, fourth place this week with 47 points is Mr. Darren. Woohoo! Now you can join those girls that are fading on the beach. Mm -hmm. All right, third place this week with 49 points is Mr. Mark. Woohoo! Well done. And second place this week. With 53 points is Mr. Bill. <laughs> How did this and happen? <laughs> first place this week with 58 points is Mr. Gray. <laughs> the yeah. grumpy tree. Gray amazing. We had four good covers and one bad oh, the dream. Oh, nice. <laughs> yeah, Nicky Day. All right, Mr. Gray. Okay, okay. I've had it. I've I've had it. Um, where was it? I've gone. Was there titles with numbers in or numbers in the title? Ah, oh, so for like example, fuck's Gen sake! So like Gen thirteen. Oh, no, not a number. Yeah. I hate numbers yep. covers. Gen 13, it's not, it's not a numbers theme, Matilda. It's not a numbers issue number. It's, it's titles of a comic with numbers in it. So every yeah, but it's going to have to have numbers three, in the fucking Gen thumbnail. 13. So every oh. single Fantastic Four is in the play. Oh, there you go. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Right. I, th I think you can rename, rename the theme to Fantastic Four. I like that one. <laughs> 
Yeah, that'd Absolutely. be a bit boring. I think you should do five different titles. Not try, not you know, try and do five different titles. Anyway, I'm going to spin it. Which but hold on. Is it like the first, first spin, spin, the second win? Oh, you messed it all up, Darren. By <laughs> gosh, by golly. The first spin you is always the win. <laughs> the third one. Absolutely. Yeah, well, that's and that's uh, that's Mister um, uh, Bill's favorite up. moment in the whole in the entire week. Please no chantress. Please no chantress. Please no chantress. Oh no! That is choice. Oh, where is it? I really need to write down. Some if you want to choose something that's already on the wheel, Matilda. So uh, choose one that's already on the wheel so we can knock it off the wheel. Yeah. Or make up a no, new one. no, no, read them to me. Right. None of them are mine. Long hair, <laughs> candy, magic, looking for. Oh, I want candy. I was just thinking about candy. Candy. <laughs> candy. candy it is. I want candy. Do, do, ah, do, do, yeah. do. Okay, so it's candy then next week. Yay. Sweeties, as we call them in the UK. I'm I'll sure dress up like a on, sucker. You can lick me, Gray Man. I have to. <laughs> oh, yeah. Well, uh, Mr. Gary, you should yeah. get out some wrappers Lollipops. and make yourself a sweater. <laughs> yeah. I, I'm not licking Cap's Tootsie Roll, that's for sure. Oh, <laughs> All right. Cheers, Gary. Go to the Creamy Center. Bye, everyone. I don't care how many weeks it takes to get to the middle of it. I'm not interested. That's the end of the show. It's Thank time you, everyone. to sign off, man. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Have a great amazing As usual, Cap is the butt of the joke. Have a great amazing day. Have a great amazing day. Have a great amazing day. And he brought a butt. Mm-hmm. <laughs>